five, four, three, two, one. Antares taking Northrop Grumman's commercial resupply mission 19 into orbit to the International Space Station. Flight controllers reporting a nominal ascent for Antares. Attitude nominal. Core pressurization is nominal. Engines remain at 100% thrust. Steady. Stage 1 TBC is nominal. Attitude nominal. Vehicle attitude remains nominal. Pressure power is nominal. A uh, vehicle passing through max Q. Vehicle now passing through max Q. Max Q is the maximum dynamic pressure experienced on Antares. Core pressurization valves are nominal. Engines remain nominal and steady. LCA, your go. Godspeed, Antares. Thank you, LCA. Half through the burn, 100 seconds to Miko, passing to 30,000 feet. Attitude nominal. Attitude remains nominal. Engine remains nominal, steady at 100%. Engine passing through 5,000 feet per second. Core pressurization remains nominal. Electrical power is nominal. TVC remains nominal. Engines remain nominal. Electrical power is nominal. Core pressurization is nominal. We're approximately 40 seconds from Miko. Slow throttle down has begun. Attitude nominal. TVC preset down slew has started. Attitude remains nominal. Three minutes into the flight of Antares, we got about 15 seconds until main engine cutoff. Rapid throttle down, steady 55% thrust. And we have main engine cutoff. Elvis is taking care of business. We have stage separation. Switching to animation with confirmed stage separation as we lose Antares into the clouds on this hazy ACS evening. Enabled. ACS is enabled. Stage two ignition time expected at a mission time 2.46. Stage one ignition expected in probably six, stage two ignition expected in approximately ten seconds. The fairing is separated. And Terry's currently in a coast phase. Stage two ignition and TBC battery is nominal. Second stage solid rocket motor has ignited. Power remains nominal. The stage will burn for two minutes and forty four seconds. The Caster 30XL will burn for approximately 2.5 minutes. Power remains nominal. Stage 2 TVC is nominal. Flight controllers report reporting good performance on the second stage. Power remains nominal.
TVC remains nominal in stage two. And power's nominal. We are approximately 100 seconds from stage two burnout. Attitude still nominal. Attitude remains nominal. TVC is performing nominally. Power remains nominal. Stage two TVC remains nominal. Power is nominal. TVC remains nominal. 50 seconds to stage two burnout. TVC, electrical power remain nominal. TVC and power remain nominal. We're beginning to see a tail off in the motor pressure, and we have stage two burnout. Six minutes, 55 seconds into the flight, the second stage solid rocket motor has burned out. ACS enabled. We're now entering about approximately a two-minute coast phase. Antares is in orbit and will coast for roughly 100 seconds prior to payload separation. Seven minutes, 45 seconds into the flight of Antares. After spacecraft separation, it will take approximately two hours, 30 minutes uh, until the solar arrays are unfurled to start collecting power uh, for the Cygnus vehicle. Shortly after spacecraft separation, we'll have a representative from the International Space Station program online to provide some comments on the flight of Antares and uh, some comments on Cygnus's journey to the International Space Station. We'll plan to wrap our coverage shortly after orbital insertion, but please stay tuned uh, for updates online on the solar array unfurl. Spacecraft separation is uh, coming up on 30 seconds. Power remains nominal. Vehicle continues to coast prior to payload separation. And we have payload separation. 